Now, as you know, a circle is an infinite set of points that are equidistant from the center. Okay? And what we're going to do now is actually take a look at finding the equation for a circle. What we're looking at is a circle with radius 4 centered on the origin. Okay? So what we know is that we have the origin, so we have the point 0, 0, and we have a bunch of points that are 4 units removed from there. Okay? So we don't know what a specific point is, we just know it to be x, y, and we know that the distance from the origin is 4. What we can do is use the distance formula because we're looking at a distance between a point and the origin. So hopefully you remember the distance formula as distance is equal to the square root of x minus x1 squared plus y minus y1 quantity squared. Okay, so for all we have to do in this case is our distance from the origin to our point is just our radius, in this case 4, and we're dealing, the point we know is 0, 0. So we can just plug in 0, 0 for x1 and y1, and what we end up with is 4 is equal to x squared plus y squared and a giant square root over that. Okay? x minus 0 is just x squared is x squared, y minus 0, y, y squared, y squared. Okay, so what I want to do now is get rid of this square root. All I have to do is square both sides, and what we end up with is 16 is equal to x squared plus y squared. Okay, so that is the particular equation for this specific circle. What I want to do now is look at the general equation. Okay, so for a general equation, let's say we have radius r and we are centered around the point hk. Okay? We're still going to go to our distance formula. And so our distance in this case is going to be the distance from the center to the outside, which is just r. So we're going to end up with r is equal to the square root of difference of x's. Our first x is just a variable. Minus h quantity squared plus y minus k quantity squared, we're taking the square root of all that. Then, just like we did before, we want to square both sides to get rid of that square root. And what we end up with is r squared is equal to quantity x minus h squared plus y minus k quantity squared. And this is the general equation for a circle. Okay? So we know the, by looking at it, we'll know the center and we'll also know the radius.